What's up everybody, it's me, Michael McCune. I'm at you with another video and and I'm sorry guys, but for um being away from YouTube for a while. But for the last couple of days I've been going through a lot of shit and it just hurts to know it's all my fault. And I would tell you all, but I know the love like my true fans mostly all my true fans but ones that just hate down in the comments they can go fuck themselves and it's just I would tell you but I don't want them it's none of their business the people that talk shit so I'm not beefing with lame motherfuckers on here so but anyway this is the Q&A hope you guys enjoyed this video please like and subscribe if you want more Q&As from me, um, this summer I'm going somewhere, um, film, some, film some ghost videos for you, um, but anyways, let's get in this Q&A, um, let's <sighs> sorry guys, I just, what I'm going through right now is just painful, man. Right, let's get into these comments, questions. Oh, thank you all for the 1K views overnight. Cannot believe you guys did this. Thank you all. Without you, I wouldn't be anything. Um, and of course, YouTube's taking away my likes, and they took a lot of my views. But it's whatever. YouTube's like I'm not gonna say anything. I'm just you know, I'm just gonna shut up. This video is already going to get demonetized anyway, so. But anyways, I did make my retirement notice, and I might have something cooking up in the pot. I don't know yet. It's just, I don't know. But let's get into these comments. I mean, I don't want to do this. If you not heard my retirement notice, check it out. All right, 26 questions, all right. Um, Charles, Charles Dickman. <laughs> Funny name, dude. Hey, where the Q&A? Right here, bro. I'm doing it. Um, Nugget Man. <laughs> I fuck with these names, I really do. Um, how's your career going? Dude, it could be a lot better. Seriously, like... Where I live right now, it's just... It's not my thing. And... A lot of shit's holding me back, but... The people that's holding me back, it's not their fault, so... But... I'm getting there. Um, this summer, I'm... Going on vacation. And I'll probably be myself by myself... I don't know yet, but, and another question, um, you have another question, do you still love your fans, of course dude, I love all of you, even the haters, I love you too, you know, without you guys, I mean, I would be weak, I said it in my retirement notice, what's next for YouTube, same dude, Nugget Man, um, what's next for YouTube, um, I haven't, like I said, I'm planning to go on vacation this summer. Um, I'm not going to tell you where yet. That'll be a separate video. Um, that might be a different Q&A. You guys can, one of y'all can ask a question about that. And it just, we'll see, man. But um, I want to travel. I want to go around the world, go to make videos, hauling stuff. That's basically next for me. Even though I have done that in my past years when I first started YouTube, but they weren't haunted places. I mean, I made a video last year on um, Molly State Park, abandoned hospital. You might want to check that out. Um, sucks I couldn't get in it, but I mean, I interviewed a guy and, you know, he told me a lot about the place and 
Uh, really cool video. You should check it out. Alright, uh... Pete Pesto did that did sorry if I pronounced your name wrong, dude. Um Pestadero, um Peter Pestadero from Bob's Burgers. I'm just kidding, dude. Dude, you're awesome, and I know your girlfriend. I love her. LOL. I mean, thanks for the compliment, but... Kind of disrespectful, so... I mean... Cool, cool. I'm not mad. I'm not gonna get mad. But it's kind of disrespectful, so... But thanks for the compliment. Um, pesto is another pesto. Um, Dad, Jay, sorry if I'm pronouncing your name wrong, dude. I'm dissing you on my new diss track. Why? <laughs> oh my god. You're one of those people. Okay, go for it. Honestly, I want to hear it. And if it sounds good, and if it's good, um,. I may may not respond. We'll see. But cool. Look what look what happened to the last dude I dissed. Where is he? Nowhere to be found. So cool. Good luck. Another question from you. You're fake and I got mine released. How are you gonna call, you give me a compliment in the beginning and you're gonna talk all this shit and you're gonna say I'm fake? Do you even know me? Bro, you're just hating at this point, like, why are you hating on somebody that you don't even know? I mean, I sure as hell don't know you, but, I mean, come say it to my face. If, if you're gonna, like I said, I'm not beefing with you, I'm not beefing with motherfuckers on here, I'm not beefing with anybody anymore. If you got a problem with me, come say it to my face. So... I was gonna like you at first, but, you know what... Whatever, dude. Alright. Dylan Hivage. Dylan, I know this is you. Are you gay? Oh, my God. Why do I have to answer this? No, I'm not gay. <laughs> why? Uh, out of every question you could have asked me, why did you say, am I gay? Bruh. <laughs> Whatever, dude. Charles Dickman. Um, is that the same Charles Dick? I don't know. But, what's your dream? Um, I kind of explained it. My dream is to go travel around the world and do haunted videos around the whole world. You know, I want to live my life as best I can and not just visit haunted places, but, you know, go to different places. Like, Las Vegas, have fun. Um, Los Angeles, have a good time. It gets around doing shit, camping, just, just living my life, you know? Because I was really negative most of my life, and I'm just now getting confident in myself. I'm still a little negative, but most of the part, I'm confident, so. A good question, man. Uh, DJ Finnick. J D, uh, I sorry, dude. I can't pronounce your name, but I apologize, dude. Why are you quitting? That's my question. <sighs> this one's kind of hard to explain. I'm first of all, I'm quitting because really, it just doesn't interest interest me no more. I can't even say interest, but. It just doesn't interest us, like interest me anymore, and it's just uh, I don't have a lot of time as I used to. Um, I got a lot of shit that I do now, help the family around and um, stuff like that. It's just 
But like I said, I might have something cooking in the pot. You know, you never know. Um, I'll update you though. But good question. Rayford Page. Is this Dylan again? Or or your or his dad? Is this your dad doing? I think it's you, dude. I don't know. Why did you be gone so long? Uh, I'm not. I'm gonna. Most YouTubers will sit here and lie to you. Me, I'm gonna tell the God's honest truth. I I I have been lazy. Um, I'm not gonna lie. I was lazy a lot, and I just. I don't know. I just. Laziness, but a lot of it wasn't laziness. A lot of it was, again, my dad, he lost his leg. He's been, he's been going to the hospital back and forth, and I just, you know, I had to take care of him. And he's in the nursing home now, so, but, but that's pretty much why. But I'm, I'm done being laziness. I am coming back full time. Um, I'm going to try my best, at least two, three videos a week, I'm going to try. Um, that might not start until I actually go to where I'm going this summer. Um, the rages, I don't know about the rages, if any of y'all care about them anymore. I mean, if you want me to do more, hey, um, put it in the comments. I mean... You put anything in the comments you want me to do. Hell, I want you to give me ideas to do. John Cena. Brapple juice! <laughs> you can't see me! Okay, that was lame. John Cena versus The Rock was one of the best rivalries of all time. Um... But, um, love your name, dude. Are you the real John Cena? <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, are you coming to D.C., please? Um, I wanted to go to D.C. Yeah, I actually want to go to D.C. There's so many places I want to film. Um, D.C., that's in West Virginia or Virginia? It's been so long since I've did history. I mean, I've been out of school for a long time, like three, four years. Um, wait, I think two years. I don't know, but when I got homeschooled, I just didn't like learn as much as I did in public school. So the last thing I learned at public school was probably seventh grade, and that was years. So I think that was all the way back in 2013, so... But yeah, I am going to DC. I don't know when. Um, but yes, I am coming to DC, and um, we can hang out. Um, we can do whatever, dude. We can. Um, I'll invite you to one on a haunted investigation with me. Um, but I can't really pay for your um, stuff. <laughs> Because it's a lot of money, and I just, but for sure, dude. I mean, I mean, I'll help you uh, get some things. Like I'll pay for some of your stuff, but like, I don't know. But hell yeah, dude. We can hang out. We can camp, fish, whatever you want to do. Um, hike. Um, we can invite. I'll invite you to haunted places. I want to visit the White House. I don't know if you're allowed to. I think you are, but the White House is, like, one of those haunted places on Earth, if you did not know that. Probably didn't, or you probably did, but yes, it's very haunted. Um, the ghost of George Washington haunts it, um, I think Abraham Lincoln, um, so many other presidents, um, other ghosts, spirits, you know, it's haunted. And there's a lot of places in D.C. that's haunted. But yeah, I, I'm definitely coming to D.C. I don't know when, no, but 
It'll be, it'll be sometime, I promise you that. It might be next year, you never know. But I want to go to California next year, so if any of y'all are in California, we can meet up, we can do whatever, man. Um, but, good question, dude. Uh, uh, sorry, I got a text. Um, Dylan hit. Dylan Hidge, another question. Are you coming back to Texas? I've never been to Texas, dude. Don't get me wrong, I want to go to Texas. There's a lot of haunted places, a lot of fun shit to do in Texas. Um, but I've never been to Texas, dude. <laughs> like, I want to go to Texas, don't get me wrong, but... Um, yeah, that's one of my dream places too, Texas. I really want to visit there. It's a um, big ass state, lots of things to do, lots of haunted investigations. Um, poopy seed. <laughs> poopy seed. Um, cool g um name, dude. Um, you're going crazy. Are you going to go live? Thank you, dude. Um, yeah, I was spazzing on that beat. Rap guy beat, and that was hard to do. And I'll admit a lot of the parts of the song, I kind of like lost on beat and stuff. But um, I did my best. I tried. Um, I was going to pick a different beat because that's more of a remix. But I wanted to be something. I wanted to spaz one last time for you guys. And I wanted to prove to y'all that I can rap. I can rap fast. I can do this. I, I, I can rhyme word. I can change my flows, you know? And I kind of proved it in Rap Guide. I had so many different flows, crazy bars. Um, I proved to people I can rap fast. Because when I actually had a diss battle between a former friend of mine, we had diss battles back to back. He said I couldn't rap fast. He doubted me, see? Now, he probably viewed that song and he's looking stupid as fuck. So. And I got more views than him in his whole fucking life, so. And he knows who he is, too, so. But, thank you, dude. Love your compliment, bro. I like it now. I'm actually gonna like all your stuff. Sorry, guys. Uh. I'm just talking too much. Sierra Lashy. Oh, it starts with a C instead of an S? I know a Sierra. Um, she's my friend's girlfriend. She, uh, you said you're cute if you're single. Hit me up. Uh, thank you. Um, I'm not single, really. Um, actually, it's complicated right now. Um, I'm not gonna... I don't want to talk about it because, you know... It just... It hurts to know it's all my fault, and I wish I could go back in time and take it all back, but you know. Um, right now it's complicated, so um, but I appreciate the, comp appreciate the compliment. Thank you so much for your compliment. Um, TJ Schools. Yo, TJ Schools, what's up, dude? Hey, where you been, bruh? Like, bruh, I've been making videos for two years now and i haven't got one compliment about you or anything bro you never i'm just kidding with you bro but how you been dude um i missed you bro um we should totally hang out sometime um you're one of my first fans and thank you for being loyal and respectful and from the bottom of my heart bro i love you all and I love my day one fans because they've been there since day one and they've never unsubscribed. They understand what I went through and TJ Schools is one of them. So, but how you met? How you been, bro? Um, you have Snapchat, Instagram, hit me up. Um, my snap, my Snapchat is Michael McCune 24, M I C H A E L, no spaces, M C C U N E 24. No space. Okay. <laughs> and my Instagram is Mike McCune22. M-I-K-E. No spaces. M-C-C-U-N-E. 
in um, 22. Yeah. So hit me up, man. Um, we can chat, hang out sometime, maybe. Um, I know um, if you live in a good um, state and you have a lot of haunted uh, places that I want to, um, I might be interested in investigating, hit me up. I would love to hear what you got for me. You can even go with me sometime, you know? Do, uh, make moves and stuff, you know? Um, but this question is, hey man, it's me, the OG. How you been, bro? How's the family? Thank you, man. I know you're the OG. <laughs> you a goat, man. You're all, you're all goats. Um... I could be better right now, dude. Like, seriously, I could have been... I wish a lot of the shit I wish I wouldn't have done. Because it hurt the person more. But it honestly hurt me, too. And it's hard to live with what I've done. And I don't want to tell you or anybody in here. So, sorry if I don't tell you. And I'm fucking trying to be serious. But... You know, a bunch of fucking haters in the comp compliments will not mind their business. They'll start talking shit about me and say what I did and this and that. So I'm like, I'm not beefing with dudes on here. I mean, I told, I, I said in the beginning of the video, you got a problem with me, come say it to my face. But, um, so I could be better, bro. But thank you very much. Um, how's the family? Um, pretty good. My grandma got surgery. Um. Both of her shoulders, they had she had some kind of wire put in her. So this is some kind of new sur or I don't know if it's new, but some surgery put a wire in both your arms, and it's supposed to um, help with the pain go away and it connects to your brain, and it's supposed to make the pain go away forever in your shoulder. So um, she's feeling a little better, um, but she's got to get them taken out. Um, Thing one this month and on the other next month so but my dad he's doing uh, he, I'm saying he might lose his other leg because he's been going to the hospital back and forth now and I'm just it really breaks my heart because you know and that's another reason why I haven't been making videos because I bust my ass to do everything I can for him and because you know I owe him for everything he's done for me and, and even my mom too my mom she has seizures she's been having seizures a lot and um, I just gotta take care of the fam you know that's why I'm trying to make money off YouTube that's why I'm trying to make money off music because I enjoy that stuff and I'm still learning at the same time how to edit videos and even um, promote uh, my music and even like you know it's just a lot of stuff but yeah they're pretty good man um my brother dylan he's good and he's been um nailing the hell out of everything he's been doing um he's doing a lot better than i am right now but um i don't know if you remember him or if you know him but um shout out to dylan shout out to you tj schools um, shout out to everybody that answered me, I mean, asked me a question. But thank you for the compliment. Thank you for everything, TJ Schools. You're a real one. Let me know if you want to do something sometime. Harry Potty. <laughs> I actually love that day better than Harry Potter. Like, I've never liked Harry Potter. And you can shit on me in the comments, if, whatever. But I just, I've never been a Harry Potter fan. I tried and tried. I even read a little bit of the books, a little bit, sorry, that's my phone, notification, Instagram, but I even tried reading one of the books, I read a, a couple chapters, and I just couldn't get into it. Um, actually, the book's better than, I think, the movies look. The movies, I tried to watch one of them, I, I forget what one is, they have so many out now, but I don't know, it just wasn't my thing, you know, thought it was kind of like a rip-off of um, Lord of the Rings and The Hobbit and fucking track is coming by I hate I hate um, where I live now so much fucking noise like there's no like, there's houses around me but there's like lots of fields it's fucking ridiculous 
I live out in the country and it sucks. Like if if you like if you if you're gonna move, don't live out in the country, I'm telling you. There's hardly no good places to go, like stores wise. Um I mean there is Starbucks but um Starbucks, you know <laughs> um McDonald's, Burger King, Wendy's, um Papa John's, different pizzas, um, different grocery stores. I live in Ohio, so our grocery stores are Marks and Giant Eagle, so, and Acme, and I'm pretty sure I'm not the only state that has all those, but probably, Ohio's probably not the only state that has all those, but I don't know, but, um, but yeah. Harry Potty, I love that name, dude. <laughs> you releasing the merch. Oh, my God. Let me tell you about that. I've been trying to get help to make merch. Because I, I don't know how to do it myself. You know, I mean, I can learn how to do it myself. But it just takes so much time. And it just, uh, to me, it's just, I don't know. I'm going to try, though. I'm going to really try hard to make some merch for you guys. Um, so I'm trying to come up with a, like a paranormal group name, um, comment down below if you really, really have some good ideas to call our, the, um, subscribers, all you guys and me, um, like a family name, um, something paranormal or something badass, and, um, I've changed the name of this YouTube name, instead of Mike21 to, you know, of what we are fam and stuff so but let me know down in the comments below please comment i really want to know a good name i can't think of any uh paranormal researchers paranormal searchers eh. uh, i don't know but let me know let me know down in the below but merch i'm gonna try my ass off dude um and i'll be releasing tons of merch um as the years go by months and years go by there will be new merch I will be making and stuff. And I'm not going to make them too expensive because, you know, there's a lot of people that don't have the money to afford that. And I totally understand. So, but let me know a price range, what I should make them. I'll let you guys decide it. But good question, dude. Harry Potty. And it's not in Harry. It's not even H... I, I just saw the I. Why? <laughs> I'm an idiot, dude. I'm so sorry, bro. H-A-R-R-Y. That's Harry for Harry Potter. But it's Harry, like, you're Harry on your head or, you know, your beard, which is my beard, shitty as fuck. Uh, I can't grow a good beard. I don't know why. It pisses me off because, you know, that's, like, one of the best things about, like, being a man and stuff, you know, but fuck it. <laughs> but, um... Dylan Hiv, Hidge, and I can't even say your name, dude. How is you and Dean? I'm his friend. He's been gone for a while. Dylan, bro, can you? I know this is you, bro. How's you, bro? I don't know where Dean has been, to be honest. Um, I don't know. I, I don't know why you asked me that, but I mean, I honestly don't know. Um. Last thing I heard from him is he hates. He said he hates my guts. So I don't know, bro. Um, you got another question, Dylan Hiv. How's the music group going? What's your next album coming out? Retirement notice, dude. <laughs> um, if I do decide to continue, um, I probably won't be releasing an album to the end of the year because I don't. Making an album is really, like, hard to do, for me at least. For you, like, other rappers and stuff. See, I'm signed to Almighty Records. Shout out to Almighty Records. Um, and I think the, the, I'm getting released because, you know, I'm retiring. So I don't know if I'm getting released or not, but... But if they release me, I'm fine with it. Um, hope they don't because, you know... They've been there since day one, and shout out to Almighty Records. Um, but, good question, Dylan. Um, but, 
Yeah, I don't know, bro. Sure as hell ain't gonna be now. <laughs> uh, Frank. Sorry if I got your last name wrong, dude. Um, what's the... Oh, how you been, bro? I've been good. I mean, not now. I could have been way better. I could be way better right now. I'm going through a lot of shit right now. And, you know... I've taken a few L's, man. You know, I've taken a lot of L's. I've taken a lot of L's, and I've taken a big L right now. So, and it's my fault. I was the dumbass, and I'm the one that did it. So, you know, I don't know. People make mistakes. Um, I'm not perfect. None of us are. But still, that's not an excuse for what I've done. So, I don't know. But I could be way better right now, bro. Like, I was in my feelings really, really bad last night and this morning. Um, I had to get a shower, like, get cleaned up, you know, just sit down, watch a horror film, you know, try to get my mind off of things, but, you know, it's not easy, man. It's just, but, yeah, I could be better, bro. Thank you for, for asking, man. For, uh, another question from Frank. What's the vibes? Um, I got to, someone else was asking me something like that. Basically, I'm trying to do full time now, I'm going back to full time. Um, I want to travel the world, make haunted videos, just live my life to the fullest because you only get one life and you can die. Tomorrow's not promised. You can die any moment. And it's just. See, don't do what I did. What I've done is I'm 22 and I, I've been negative most of my whole life, all the way from 20 years old. I was, or almost 20, actually 21. I didn't start being confident until I was, I'm 22 now. So it took me 21 years to learn how to be confident. Like, I mean, when I was little, I mean, I didn't really know what that was, or like, I don't think none of us do, but like, when I was like eight, I don't know, it didn't start till like when I was in my teens, like 12 years old. So, mostly 12 to 20, 12 to 21. Nine years. It took me nine years to um, finally start being confident. So, and really, I, I Dylan helped me. He's he's my brother. You know, he helped me get through it. And you know, without him, I wouldn't be anything.